Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're we'll learning about solving inequalities, and this is our critical thinking question. So, we're given this question. Let's go right. An inequality with x on both sides whose solution is x is greater than or equal to 2. Alright? Well, what I like to do here is kind of, in a sense you can, let's see, it's a kind of trial and error kind of thing um, with kind of planning ahead. It's up to you how you want to do it. Uh, some people like to work backwards by taking the solution and just add a few things to both sides and kind of keep it even, but why don't we get, let's look at this. So if I just had 2x, right, is greater than or equal to x plus 2, okay? And this is going to be our solution. I'm going to see why, kind of check why it is, right? Well, what happens, let's look, look at this. So if I subtracted an x, I kept this, the 2 there is because we know the whole thing's going to be equal to 2. And I know 2x is just one more than regular x that I needed right there. So by putting an x on the right-hand side here, I know if I was to solve this, I would subtract an x to both sides. Leave me what I needed, right? The 2 comes down. We have less than or, or equal to right here, still less than or equal to. And then 2x minus x is just x, right? So, again, what I would recommend, now there's many solutions, right? Many solutions, here's this possible one of them. It's just that 2x is greater than or equal to x plus 2. So let's do a quick recap. We're given the question of writing a uh, right inequality with x on both sides, whose solution is x is greater than or equal to 2. Okay? So they get they want the x on both sides there. Now, I was given just two, uh, what I wrote here, just 2x is greater than or equal to x plus 2. Okay? And then I subtracted x both sides to show that I would get my solution. If I did want to write work backwards, I guess this is another way to talk about it. x is greater than or equal to 2. All right, since I have to add it, have an x on both sides, let's just add an x, right? Add an x to both sides, like this, right? So now we're left with x, or 2x, right? x plus x is 2x, is greater than or equal to, well, x plus 2, right there. And that's where I would get that solution. So it's another way of kind of going about it, looking at it that way. Um, kind of starting with your answer and then saying, hey, I can add an x to both sides. There's no x there. Let's go add one to both sides, right? Because you have to do it to both sides, but that's fine. That's legal in mathematics. And so we got a final answer here. A possible solution of 2x is greater than or equal to x plus 